new school year, everyone. I would like to just talk a minute about transition tips. And the song that has just been loved forever as the best transition ever for scarves is The Colors Are Gliding. So our little ones maybe have trouble folding scarves. It's funny because in our studio classes, we get the children very young, one, two, you know, babies, uh, three-year-olds, and they already are working on, on folding their scarves. But my pre-K, K, even grade one, <laughs> two in the schools, don't know how to fold the scarves. So we have our beautiful colors, our gliding verse, and then when it's time to lay out our colors. Now we'll take our colors and lay them out flat. Fold them all neatly like this and like that. Often they just come up to me. You know, they, here, here you go. Go ahead and fold it for me. So we need a little instruction at the beginning of the year and it's such a beautiful, beautiful organized way to get these scarves all put away. So we just say, pick this side up and bring it to here. Pick this up and bring it over here. Lay it on top of that side. Now pick up this side and lay it on top of this side. Great, now pick this up and bring it over here. Pick this up and bring it over here and it's ready to go in your basket or backpack or bin or wherever you're putting your scarves. So beautiful way to get them put away. Plus, you know what I just, I really love the flow of the scarves when they're not all wrinkled in a crunchy bunch. So that's a great way to teach them to do that. Now, the colors are gliding is a beautiful exploration time for them to just freely move and you're not giving them any specific directions at all. Maybe you're gliding, you know, the colors are gliding all around. Maybe you're, you're moving up high, up low, you're turning around and giving them some ideas, but it's creative movement while you're singing the song. But there's other verses too, and sometimes you need just a little bit more movement. You've done your scarf activity, and this is always the closing scarf activity. So you might say, how else could we move with our scarves? So maybe, the colors are jumping all around, the colors, and they can move around and the colors are jumping. What, uh, what other things can the colors do? The colors are sliding. <laughs> the colors are sliding all around. The colors are slithering all around. The colors are slithering. The colors are pointing all around. The colors are pointing. Let the children come up with some creative movement verses just as a variety as your school year goes on to your transition sign. The other thing I love about Colors Are Gliding is the easy accompaniment. So you hear in the recording, and I certainly would introduce it with the recording, uh, Colors Are Gliding is on Kids Make Music, Babies Make Music 2 album. But this is, you can just hear, this is just a pentatonic. size of metallophone, I remove the E's and the B's play along with the recording or have the children make up their own accompaniment. So very creative. Transitions should be musical. They hear talking all week long. For me, I only see my children once a week. This short little 30 to 45 minute time is the only music many of these children will hear during the week. I want to sing through transitions. I want to have it rhythmic and exciting uh, for the older students. Maybe we don't sing through a transition. Maybe we do, let's make a circle. Let's make a circle. Pretty soon I don't have to even say it. They know. 
they know what that means. Um, so transitions that are very engaging, very musical, and something very different from what they're hearing speaking in their classroom. I hope you have a great year. Lots and lots of transition songs in the Kids Make Music, Babies Make Music 2 book. Um, and also, of course, members um, music box and, and in the curriculum, lots and lots of awesome musical ways to have transitions. All right, wishing you a musical school year. Uh, talk to you soon.